So my name is Shiva Dusa. I'm with the European Investment Bank. And one of the, my mission tonight is actually to redefine for you the European Investment Bank. Usually the bank is known for infrastructure, for having contributed to the Canary Wharf, to Eurostar, uh, you know, Eurotunnel. What I would like to have you think about is EIB, the I standing for innovation, the European Innovation Bank. The other thing I would like you to sort of leave um, tonight with as a thought, and we'll go into that tomorrow, is that innovation can be funded not just through grant funding with the, by the public sector, but through innovative finance instruments. And you'll hear tomorrow about an, uh, the new, hor on the horizon 2020, the new InnoFin financing products, which are blended products where the European Commission seven years ago had a smart idea of actually putting some of the grant funding into a blended financing instrument with the European Investment Bank to do risk sharing of innovation of innovative products of, of uh, companies we finance over 14 billion euros in the last seven years and we have an even more a bigger more ambitious program in the next seven years um, so what I would like to leave you with as a thought is that um, you know the name of the game for innovation as a public sector institution as a European innovation bank is to have leverage to have multiplier effects to have impact, and that can be achieved by governments looking at similar ways of using innovative finance in across the value chain and not just using grants. Their grants can go much further if they blend them with other instruments. Uh, for the private sector, this means more long-term patient capital because we are there in good times as well as in bad times. And um, going to Carlotta's point, there are not always enough good projects, but that's why we now have also innovation advisory, which is an area that I am heading, to help uh, good projects prepare for such financing to improve their access to innovative financing. So more on that tomorrow, but um, so basically the European Innovation Bank and how you can use innovative finance for innovation.